Well, here's a little update on our swarm that we caught a week or so ago. Uh, there's still bees on the box, traffic in and out, so that, that's a good sign that they're going to stay. So I'm going to get this down and move them over and set them up in my backyard. And I've actually got another swarm. I don't think y'all can see it. Maybe. Oh yeah, right there in the center of the screen. You can still see the bees flying around right near in between those dead limbs on that dogwood tree. Got another one just kicked out, about a pound and a half swarm. So another one of these little late summer swarms. Um, but anyway, let's work on this one first. Let's get these girls down and get them set over somewhere in the shade so where they're not too hot. And uh, then we'll see about catching the other one. All right, I got this one at least. But look, I got to show her to you guys. Special edition. Collector's edition. She's black. Darn near black. She's dark, dark, dark. I wish she'd turn over so she could see her back. Oh, she's dark. I love them. I miss them. Shoot. Oh, yeah. That's eh, hard for y'all to see, I know. But she is a dark queen. She's pretty. Anyway, this, uh, this swarm's bigger than I realized, too. You know, that day we caught them. I told my helper, I said, you know, I'll be honest with you, man. I normally wouldn't even go after a swarm that size. They're just too little. Not worth it. But they're healthy. They're a they're healthy little swarm. Um, and that queen's already doing an awesome job. I dug through, look, she's already laying. She's already got some small larvae. They've got honey they packed in here already. Excellent, excellent, excellent. I think these are going to do good.